How's it going everybody? Shockwave984 here and today is going to be an anime and manga haul for August and I was initially going to do a Right Stuff uh, birthday sale haul but the uh, I just found out that the last package that I ordered uh, finally shipped so uh, yeah because there was a pre-order item in there that I was waiting for to get back in stock so uh, what I'm going to do is wait until that comes in that way I can show it all together so uh, yeah so what this is going to just going to be a regular haul so uh, there's quite a bit to get through so let's go ahead and get started so the uh, manga go ahead and start out with One Punch Man Volume 8 there we go it's a pretty goofy cover at first I thought uh, he was like throwing a punch or something but no he's slamming a controller <laughs> really cool and there's like a little uh, story here in the back there we go yeah it looks pretty funny <laughs> next up we have volume 9 there we go and uh, as far as I know uh, zoom out a bit the there is no second season that's been approved yet. I haven't seen anything because uh, I know that the uh, I remember reading that the author was doing his best to try and get a second season up and running or he was in talks about it. So there you go. Here's volume 10. You see a character right there. That looks like fun. <laughs> uh, so yeah. So not quite sure what the, the status is on that. I mean I haven't read anything or heard anything about it so there you go because that was a uh, a while ago when I read that and then here is volume 11 now at the time um, this was the latest to be released so I want to say volume 12 might be out already or I think it's uh, still up for pre-order I know it was up for pre-order when uh, when I picked this up so so this is a combination of stuff that I got a uh, like a uh, I say about three months ago till now pretty much so maybe a little bit while longer <laughs> so uh, there you go got these on sale with something else so I'll be showing that next up we have Soul Eater picked up some more there you go here is volume 13 and here's the back looks really cool here is volume 14 with Excalibur I hope I did that right <laughs> he was hilarious in the uh, uh, when we saw him in the anime because I mean we didn't know about that as far as I, I don't remember hearing about his character at all because I think we just saw the trailers and stuff for Soul Eater it's like huh that looks interesting and then uh, once he appeared, we're just like, huh? <laughs> so here is volume 15. So currently, this is where we're at uh, volume-wise uh, as far as uh, uh, owning them. So we just need 10 more, and then we'll have all of Soul Eater. There we go. There we go. So yeah, I just need 10 more. And then last up for the manga, Yotsuba Volume 13. So this is the latest to be released. Excuse me. Uh, for Yotsuba. Um, really great slice of life. Uh, comedy. Uh, yeah, it's got comedy. There's some drama. There's really great writing in here. I really like the characters. And uh, the only thing about Yotsuba is uh, it takes a very long time for this, for this to get re-released. Because Volume 12 was the latest for quite a while. So maybe that'll shorten one day. Uh, oh, let me show you the spine there. There you go. And actually, let me show the... forgot to show the spines here. So there we go. Those are for Soul Eater. And then these are for 
One Punch Man. There we go. Okay, so that does it for the manga. And now let's go and get into the anime. Now all the anime is used except for one. So I'll get into that in a bit. The Legend of the Dog Warriors. The Hakenden. This I remember seeing parts of, but never finishing it. Uh, I, don't, I don't recall ever finishing it. This is a 13 episode uh, OVA that uh, it features like samurai and stuff like that. Like uh, they fight like demon forces and things like that. So yeah, 13 episodes. Yeah, and this is a OVA. But I remember liking what I saw, uh, the, the parts I saw. So very happy to have this. There you go. Yeah, really cool. And also, uh, let's see. I'm going to put that right there. And uh, I meant to put two others off to the side, so that way I gotta, the ones I put in the middle don't fall over. Uh, so here we go. Eden's Bowie. The complete collection. This is a thin pack set by ADV. Found this for ten dollars. Uh, looked like it got marked down. And uh, this is a series I saw a long time ago, and I really remember liking it. And uh, I went ahead and rewatched it, or, or I'm on. Uh, I'm currently rewatching it. I'm on uh, this four. Yeah, this four. So yeah, pretty cool series. Found a really good price. And then uh, I'll go ahead and put the, the one new series. Uh, the one thing I picked up new. One Punch Man. Yes, the limited edition. It comes with a gift with purchase. Which uh, comes with like a little pin. There you go. And it just comes with like a little slip cover. Like that. It looks really cool. Here's the back. There you go. And you also get a uh, booklet, which is right there in the red. And this just comes out like that. And more sticky notes. And there we go. There is uh, their standard uh, edition as well. So there we go. And I picked this up on a sale. Uh, it was one of those, uh, like you type in the coupon, uh, like code and stuff, and you get a pretty good... Uh, sale price marks them down and I got this along with the four volumes of uh, the manga as well so yeah really good deal there we go so yeah nice slip cover and then all this you also get six OVAs as well so there we go okay so that's better there we go that'll hold those in place next up we have Another OVA series, Alien Defender Geo Armor Keishin Corpse. This I've never heard of. Um, but then um, when I found it, I did some research on it. And because uh, this I remember seeing at a convention, uh, this this same box set. Uh, it was uh, kind of pricey there, so um, I didn't pick it up then. But uh, I did some research on it, and uh, it sounded pretty cool. Uh, like the story and stuff uh, it sounded really neat so I checked it out and uh, yeah pretty cool series there we go here are the disc hello <laughs> there we are and then next up we have this is just a single uh, volume but uh, it's two series that I eventually want to pick up if I could find it all. Master Key 10. Yes, there is an anime on this along with uh, Monster. Another one of uh, Naoki, Uro Naoki Urasawa's works. There we go. And uh, just going off this first volume, uh, excuse me, first volume, sorry about that. I really want to pick up the rest of this. And I actually did find this at a convention, the last one uh, I went to, but it was like $160. It, it was 
way up there in price probably considering how long of how long out of print this has been and I also found the one uh, DVD box set of monster that was released which only had I believe fix uh, excuse me 15 episodes on it I think um, that was going for pretty high as well so I had to pass on that but this I eventually found for like a few bucks and uh, yeah just going off this first volume really good next we have a couple live action films L changed the world yes the unwritten chapter of death note so now we have all the uh, live action movies there we go that were out at the time and uh, this I've been running on uh, Netflix because when I heard about it I was like oh there's another one okay and there we go and hats off to the actor who played L just did an amazing job really like the the job he did and then next up we have one of the goofiest live-action movies I've ever seen Jackie Chan City Hunter oh my gosh this movie is hilarious <laughs> it is goofy as heck uh, City Hunter is a long-running uh, manga which I believe believe it's it's been over as far as I know uh, if not it's still going <laughs> uh, there we go but yeah uh, there it's an anime series or it's a manga anime series it has OVAs I believe and movies so uh, yeah this has a hilarious Street Fighter parody you can just find it type it in look it up it's pretty cool there you go Next up we have Ninja Scroll, the 10th anniversary edition. Now I do have the Sentai uh, Filmworks uh, re-release of this on DVD. Uh, this is an older edition. It comes with a really neat poster, a two-sided poster. So I really wanted this one. Uh, I did have the Blu-ray, but I, I passed that on to my cousin uh, just to give it to him as a birthday gift. He, he's the one who initially showed us this. So yeah, really cool. So I think I'll show more of that later on. That way I can show you guys the poster. Just got a lot of stuff to get through. <laughs> and next up, Record of Lotus War. Or Lotus War, as I've heard it pronounced. A couple different ways. This is a fantastic OVA series. And one of the absolute best animated. It is very well done. And in fact, I believe this is what it's mostly known for is not just the story and stuff, but the animation. For that time, it is amazing. It looks really, really good. Highly recommended. And actually, this actually got re-released along with the, uh, I believe, a TV series as well. So it all got re-released in one uh, box set. So, excuse me. And uh, here is... Next up, Oh My Goddess, the movie. Yes, happened to find the film. Pretty cheap. And uh, I don't really remember the movie that much. Because um, I was thinking back, like, wait a minute, have I seen this? And uh, I want to say I have, but maybe it was just like trailers and stuff for it. But uh, yeah, um, we still don't have the second season, but yeah, I happened to find the film. There we go, and it still has a booklet, and here's the DVD, and also a pencil board, pencil board, there we go, still intact, yeah, everything's still there, really cool, there we go, and this I haven't watched yet, I've just been watching a other stuff at the moment so there we go all right we're getting down to the final stretch which blade the entire anime series uh, this is a thin pack edition and I literally watched this all in one day because <laughs> uh, I remember uh, already watching some of it and you get a ton of special features there you go 
there's a whole separate disc of special features and uh yeah because uh i never finished it um there was nothing wrong with it i just was watching other stuff at the time so there you go yeah i completed it and uh pretty good very happy to have it next up we have shangri-la this is actually a rebuy because i had the uh uh what was it the save edition but i happened to find part one with the art box pretty cheap so uh yeah i decided to go ahead and pick up the second part as well found that for a pretty good price and yeah really good and next up this is a uh, this could be pretty hard to find uh, or maybe you can find on eBay and stuff um, two heart this is excuse me this is a really nice uh, like slice of life uh, like romance series uh, I saw this a long time ago and this is a old uh, Right Stuff uh, collection that they had. And they don't have this anymore. So uh, this can be hard to find. There you go. And yes, it is. It does have a dub and stuff. There you see Thin Pack. Very happy to find this. Uh, yeah, definitely uh, like Two Heart. And uh, also, uh, they're, they're going to release the second part, Two Heart 2. I saw that up for pre-order, so, uh, yeah, really cool. And now we come down to the final two, Mezzo Danger Service Agency. So finally have the complete uh, TV series. There it goes, and thin pack collection. Zoom out of it. There it goes, now the OVA and a TV series. There we go. Excuse me. And then last up we have, uh, let's see, let's go ahead and put that together. Attack on Titan. Yes, finally picked up the first season. And yes, I did watch all of season two. So yeah, there we go. Found this used for really cheap and in pretty much, uh, or maybe not really cheap, it was still like, uh, I think $20 with, um, with tax and stuff. Yeah, so it was under 20, but then you had the tax with it. Uh, yeah, really good condition, pretty much brand new. Pretty much, so, there we go. There we go, it is a four disc set. And yeah, Attack on Titan, this is really awesome. Watched it when it was airing. Very happy to have the anime finally. So, there we go. And now let's go ahead and zoom all the way out. Let's back up a bit. There we go. Do apologize about the uh, glare, so there we go. Yeah, a little bit better. Uh, but uh, yeah, so with that, that just about does it for this video. So next up will be the, uh, depending on when the package arrives, it might be the right stuff haul. Or uh, I'm thinking about maybe doing another collection. Or a uh, collection video might be on the live action, our, our live action uh, TV show collection. So, uh, or maybe just an anime unboxing. So with that, like the video if you do, subscribe if you like, and I'll see you guys next time.